Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Right, so today's offering another stone circle, and you're gonna have to excuse that wind. It almost feels like winter. Just making his way up towards Basler Edge, over Kerber Edge, onto Edge of Frogger Edge, and there's a stone circle there we're going for. I think it's just called Frogger Edge Stone Circle or Stoke Flat, I think that one. So that was an old roadside way marker and it's modern day companion stone. So I'm just making my way up towards Wellington's monument now. Views are awesome up here, I, I really like this area. I used to spend a lot of time up here in his younger days. Well, sod's law that. Normally I have to go traipsing round here at Old Moreland looking for them, but there they are on the side at Path having a drink. But I'm not going to film them too well. I've not filmed them too much. Yeah, I'll come back and do a video one day on them. When Mrs. St. Daughters we make up the house at the little cabs. Right, Wellington's Monument. You can't help but feel pride when you see things like that one and Nelson's on the other side. If it were for like of Nelson, Wellington, this video might be being brought to you in French. God forbid. Anyway, next up, Eaglestone. Eaglestone. Climbed that back in day. I don't fancy my chances nowadays. But I'm sure I almost got stuck up there years ago. Right, so in typical Rob fashion, it's pretty much been raining since I've got here. It's only spitting, just tiny little droplets blowing about on wind, but wind is insane. 
it's probably about two degrees. Uh, stick that wind chill on, Jesus. That's like about minus 10. Uh, right, I'm pushing on out towards. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Curver edge. I'll pick you up when we get close. Well, when we get up there. Just need to get some water back into my hands. Just coming up on the end of Basler Edge now. The views are starting to open up at peaks. Spin round for you. And if you can make it, that's Carver Edge. Win Hill is there. And I think Sir William Hill is somewhere lurking round here. I've lost it. It's hard to see through a screen. It's there. <laughs> right, so it is actually meant to rain today, but not this early. Not till about tea time, and see, it's about nine o'clock in the morning now. But that will be plan. Just Kerber Edge gets extremely busy, and I don't do busy, so with a bit of luck, current rain's kept everybody away. Everything's right up there, so we might get a bit of snow up here if we're lucky. No, we're not. <laughs> we're just on Kerber Gap now, and I can uh, see car park. God, it's full. <laughs> I think I'm going to have my work cut out on editing this one. The wind. Oh, the moment you get near them edges. Oh, like being in a blast freezer. It's horrible. <laughs> it really is windy, and it's seriously got some bite to it. I can't even on camera still. <laughs> Finally got a bit of shelter from wind. Edges about 50 yard that way. But it really is picked up now. Anyway, that was Frogger Edge Stone Circle. I'm almost certain it's called Stoke Flat Stone Circle and all. I'm pretty certain somebody will let me know in comments. Les. <laughs> Les, music from music from the peaks. If you like your music, give Les' channel a watch. Does some quality stuff. Right, so I've come off at main path now. I'm literally trying to find a sheltered spot so I can make a drink because I'm freezing. It really has gone cold. It's meant to be warming up. Snow on floor here, look. Enjoy this. Cheers. I really enjoyed that. Apart from a warm host on it, 
Every time I went to have a drink, wind got in through mouthpiece, blew it out through bloody vents, ended up with all over me. Just think, oh, that went through face and everything. <laughs> but anyway, I'm back on road, look. I just didn't fancy walking across another windswept edge with them on. They're only little thin things, so. Right, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Please give us a big thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Hey, I'll see you on next one.